in Las Cruces, health care workers are protesting the governor of New Mexico's vaccine mandate. Many of them say they expect to lose their jobs this week. KTSM 9 News reporter Shelby Cap is live in Las Cruces with what both the health care workers had to say and Department of Health officials. And some of those are protesters who were protesting here in Las Cruces are healthcare workers, and they actually called into work as Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham's mandate says that they have to receive the vaccine by Friday. Now, some of those are protesting, telling us that they expect not to have a job at the end of the week due to the vaccine mandate. One nurse saying she is vaccinated, but is supporting her colleagues, saying she needs their help as there is a nursing shortage. One respiratory therapist saying she worked throughout the pandemic with COVID-19 patients holding a sign that said from hero to zero. I may have to quit my job and go outside of health care. Um, I'm hoping the governor will drop the mandate. Um, I'm going to apply for exemptions like for my cardiac condition and hopefully that goes through. Um, if not, I probably won't have a job. <laughs> During a COVID-19 update from New Mexico health officials, the New Mexico Cabinet Secretary for Health and Human Services Department, David Scar, said health care workers have some of the highest rates of COVID-19 cases. And coming up at 6, we will hear from that nurse who is vaccinated, as well as we will hear from New Mexico health officials as they say health care workers have always been required to get multiple vaccines. Reporting live in Las Cruces, Shelby Cap, KTSM 9 News.